Right now I'm going to show you how to create a patient list. Uh, it's rather simple. You will go up here to the very top where it says patient list and when you click on that you'll go to this screen. Now the reason you'd want to create a patient list is because you're going to want to have a separate list of your patients and your patients only. This is a census list. We advise that you do not create location list because based off where you're working that computer should be pointed to that location. If that location is incorrect, then that means that that computer belongs to the other floor. So for example, this says BL3S. Had I, had I come into 4 East um, and it said BL3S and that's the only thing that it showed, that would mean that that computer came from 3 South. So it needs to go back to 3 South. So let's create a personal list. We're going to want to grab these patients and throw them onto our personal list. So to do that, you would go ahead and you would select the wrench. And once you've selected the wrench, you would then hit new. And once you hit new, you would go over to custom because we're creating a custom list. Hit next. And once you've hit next, you would put your name in or put my list and hit finish. Once you've hit finish, you're going to highlight this available list and you're going to select the arrow and move it over and then you'll hit OK. Now that I've done this, I will go through and let's say I have multiple patients. I would hit the control button and hold it down and I can select multiple patients or if I just have one patient, I can select one patient. Regardless, once you've selected your patient or patients, you need to right click on one of them that is highlighted. And once you do that, you would add it to your patient list and it would select my list because it's going to show me all my custom lists. And then when I go to my list, you'll notice that there's nothing there. So I would go up here to the right hand corner and I would hit refresh. Once I hit refresh, all my patients should show up on my list.